Hello, welcome to Kapira. In today's episode, we are making Mysore Masal Dosa. For the dosa batter, soak 3 cups of idli rice and 1 cup of raw rice, 1 cup of urad dal, 2 tablespoons of chana dal and 2 spoons of methi seeds. Soak them for 6 to 8 hours. Before grinding, soak 1 cup of poha for 5 to 10 minutes. Grind them together to a smooth batter. Let the batter get fermented overnight or at least for 12 hours. Add salt to taste and add water to adjust the consistency of the batter. The dosa batter is now ready. Let us now start preparing the kent chutney or the spicy spread that we spread on the dosa. Take handful of dried red chilies and soak it for minimum of 1 hour in hot water. Add it to the mixer jar. Add half shallots, 3 to 4 pots of garlic and 2 tablespoons of grated coconut and 2 tablespoons of roasted chana dal. Add salt to taste and grind it to a smooth paste. Now let's start preparing the alu palya. In a pan add 1 tablespoon of oil, add some mustard and a pinch of asafoetida and let it crackle. Add a spoon of chopped ginger and green chilies. Mix it well and add two small sliced onions. Add one four teaspoon of turmeric, some curry leaves, three to four boiled potatoes. Add salt to taste. Mix them well and smash the potatoes. Do not smash the potatoes completely. Add half a cup of green peas and some water to adjust the consistency and cook it for 3 to 4 minutes. The palya is now ready. Let's prepare the masal dosa. In a pan, pour the dosa batter and prepare the dosa like the usual way. Drizzle some oil and spread the kem chutney. I have added excess kem chutney here because I like my masala dosa spicy. Cook it for few minutes and flip the dosa. Add butter or ghee to the dosa and flip it again. Add the palya and fold it. I love the dosa to get crispier in the pan. Remove it and serve it hot. Thank you. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe.